Greetings and welcome once again to Living Supernaturally. It's such a joy to come together uh, to meditate on God's word and spend a few moments in prayer. Today we'll be talking about the gift of righteousness. Romans chapter 5 and verse 17. For if by the one man's offense death reigned through the one, much more those who receive abundance of grace and of the gift of righteousness will reign in life through the one children what would you say if i asked you to throw away your most treasured toy into the garbage young people as you look to the future imagine being asked to forget about your main goals about marriage or about your education and what about the things that you have right now maybe some of our most prized possessions it could be a house a car a career a stock portfolio now righteousness is a legal term which says to have a right standing before god in other words your right standing before god is based upon jesus's right standing before the father the apostle paul was one of the most successful young men in his community he had the right credentials by birth by learning and life experience yet he was willing to consider all of this rubbish why certainly not for an easier life or for fame or for glory he knew that letting go was the only way to receive god's gift of righteousness through faith in jesus christ today you are righteous as jesus because your righteousness is from him he purchased it for you on the cross so when you and i received the lord jesus as our personal savior he took away all unrighteousness once for all and he has given us this gift of righteousness this righteousness is not something that we can obtain on our own achievement or through our right doing it can only be received by your right believing in Jesus are you holding on to something that is preventing you from stretching out your hand and receiving this god's gift of righteousness by faith sometimes we hold on to our achievements but the lord jesus is asking us to let go of it the gift includes forgiveness of sins a new life of service to the lord and eternal life everything that we have achieved in our life may look strangely dim in the comparison to the gift of god's righteousness through faith in jesus christ receive him as lord and the gift of righteousness will be yours let's pray father we want to thank you for your goodness and your mercy upon our life we thank you for the cross where you gave shed your blood for us you gave your life and you took us from a place of being unrighteous to be called the righteousness of god thank you for this gift of god and we thank you that it's not from our own doing but it is you who has given it to us lord and lord we pray that we will walk with this understanding we are righteous children of god and may our lives glorify you all the days of our life in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org